Hello, how are you? The title of today's video is Blender Tutorial 3 Install Add-ons, Screencast Keys and Shortcut Viewer After having prepared the last tutorial on creating a simple chair 3D model, I realized that if the key pressed and the mouse clicked accents could be displayed on the screen, it would be quite helpful, as I have seen on others tutorial on Blender. After some research, I found there are two add-ons for Blender 2.8 that can do just what I wanted. One is called Screencast Keys, another is Shortcut Viewer. I will show you how to install both of these add-ons to Blender 2.8. In my future Blender tutorials, I will start using either one of them. From my initial experiment, both of them are quite good, do the job fairly well. When I have some spare time, I will also review the Python code. Maybe someday, I will also write some add-ons for my own use or share online if really useful. First, download Screencast Keys add-ons from GitHub page. Make sure it's version 3.0, otherwise it won't work in Blender 2.8. Click the Screencast Keys zip file to start downloading. Then download Shortcut Viewer from its GitHub page. Click on the green button, then select Download Zip button. I saved the downloaded zip files to C temp folder as shown here. After download is done, let's install them in Blender. Go to Menu, Edit, Preferences, find the tab for add-ons on the left side. Click Install button on the top. Select the Screencast Keys zip file. Click Install Add-ons from File. Scroll to the installed add-on System Screencast Keys. Enable this add-on by tick the box. Scroll back to the top. Click Install button again. This time, select Shortcut Viewer zip file and install it. Scroll down to find newly installed add-on. Object Shortcut Viewer Enable it as we've done with Screencast Keys add-on. To make it persistent, click the 3-bar menu at the bottom left corner. Select Save Preferences. Close the Preferences window. In 3D Viewport, press N to open the Properties window. The newly installed add-ons show up here, Screencast Keys and Shortcut Viewer. Let's first try out Screencast Keys add-on. Click the checkbox on the top to enable it. You can change the color. Increase font size to 20. Change origin. For example, area. Click set origin. Move the mouse till the 3D viewport is highlighted in red. Click to set origin here. You can also click checkbox for last operation. Now when we use click or press mouse button, the action will show up on the screen. 
Press Shift key with middle mouse button to move the view. Zoom with middle mouse wheel. It works as expected. The settings can be changed to meet all preferences. Next, disable Screencast add-on and try out Shortcut Viewer add-on. Click Start Shortcut Viewer button. Let's dock to center. Change color to your like. Use mouse to rotate. Move view. Notice the mouse buttons are displayed with black rectangles and changed to white color when activated. The key pressed is displayed correctly. Overall, both add-ons work well, with some subtle differences. I think I will use both and switch back and forth in my future Blender tutorials. Here is a brief summary of what we have gone through in this session. Download Screencast Keys and Shortcut Viewer add-ons zip files from GitHub websites. Install in Blender and enable them after installation. Save preferences so we can use them each time we open Blender. Use shortcut key N to access add-ons menu. Thanks for watching.